In order to get this yellow circle around your cursor, there's a file that you need to download to your computer first. You'll find it in the description below. Once you've downloaded that file, you'll be able to replace your regular cursor with this customized cursor with a yellow circle around it. So first, download that file. In order to use this file, you're going to need to save it. So make sure you have save file clicked. Click OK. Now you can save this file anywhere on your computer. The most easiest place to find it is on your desktop. If you want to save this file to where you will find the other mouse cursor files, you won't be able to save to that file directly unless you're in the administrator account. And it's not recommended that you do. So first you can save it on your desktop. And locate the file on your desktop. And after you save it to your desktop, you can then copy it or move it by cutting it to the Windows file. After you open up Windows, scroll down to where you see cursors and you can paste it here. Now you will need to enter administrator password if you're not in the administrator account and there's a password set for that account. In order to be able to use your yellow cursor file, open up File Explorer. Go down to the Start menu. Just above Settings, you will see File Explorer. Now my control panel is here. If your control panel doesn't show, make sure you have Show All Folders on. Open up Control Panel. Go to Hardware and Sound. Under Device and Printers, go to Mouse. Then go to Pointers. And make sure under Scheme, you select none now the cursor you're going to be replacing is the normal select cursor go to browse it should automatically bring you to that cursor file that you saved the cursor to if you don't you can always find it the same way you found it before by going to your c drive then windows then cursors scroll down it should be at the bottom open that file and when you click apply or ok you will see that yellow cursor has been applied Clicking OK will just close it. Now, if you don't want to have this yellow cursor anymore, simply choose another option under Scheme, and you can go back to None, and it will automatically go away. And once you hit Apply, that setting will apply.